up guys, NS Relapse here. We're going to be doing a team interview with Team Supra. So it's going to be going off with the leader first, then we're going to do the co-leader, then the players. All right, so going with the leader first, Super White, what do you plan on doing with your team in the next six months? What do the leaders plan on doing? In the next six months? Um, yeah, do you guys have like any new series or um, any well, new ideas in the making? Just due to the fact that we just came back, as of right now, we don't have anything really planned as of now, but we have like our team Taj and our cams, and then... I don't know, maybe we'll be doing like top five plays or something, but nothing for sure yet. Okay, yeah, because I know Super just started up, what, like a week ago, or not even? Uh, yeah, we just restarted on the original channel of Super Gaming. Okay, and is Super recruiting at the moment? Uh, yeah, we are, but not really, like, we're not desperate for players. Like, if we see a sick player, like, we'll snatch them up, but we're not, like, going out trying to find people. Okay, and uh, is there any players in the YouTube community that you have beef with, or any of you in here have beef with? Um, I wouldn't really say so myself. What I mean, about I, I usually, I don't really instigate stuff, but if people, like, come at me, like, I just defend myself, or, like, I defend people, like, I like. Yeah. Like, some people, I don't want to call this kid out, but Era Hoops, he, he was talking shit about Supra Diz, who has a disability called Dystonia. And he was just making fun of him, and he called him a retard, and that really pissed us off. Yeah. So we called him out on that, and we didn't upload a video of anything he said, but that, I don't know, it just kind of, like, hurt me. Yeah, it's kind of like, fucked up when people do that. Turn off, bro. Okay, what about Panther, Ruski, or uh, Super BC? Do you guys have beef in the community with anybody? Ah, dude. I love everyone. <laughs> Ruski? Go ahead. Go ahead, Ruski. Uh, Air Chief's a little bitch. I'm just going to throw that out there. <laughs> okay, and then BC? The only people I have problems with are the people that don't know their facts. That's what I should say. Oh, God, have, yeah, dude. Okay, I don't like, have beef for example. with a single person. I can have beef with them about a single thing, but the thing I have a problem with is people that don't know all the facts and just go to assume and comment whatever they want in someone's video. Just yeah, think on the super <laughs> promo. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's like, okay. top 15th gen. Like, second gen, but all right. Oh, okay, okay. And uh, what's your team's rival at the moment? Uh, I would say Super PS3 Central. I mean, they kind of apologized for being dicks to us, but when we tried to come back, they like copyrighted our logo and threatened to bring Sunny to court, even though SG stands for Super Gaming, obviously. Yeah. So, well, where they thought they'd go with that, but. Okay, and this is gonna go to Super BC. So, as a co-leader, what do you do on the team mainly? What I do a lot is, is when, uh, when there's something in the chat going on between players, I usually take care of it. I do a lot of the rostering. I do a lot of recruiting, but so does Jetty and so does White and Sonny. But I just I, more, I normally take care of the normal stuff. Like uh, anything big, Sonny or White will jump in on, but anything that's just little, me or Jetty take care of, really. Okay, and this is going to go to every player. So starting off with Super White, what team were you in before Supra? Uh, before Supra, I was the leader of TSU. Okay, and you left TSU for Supra? Yeah, I left TSU for Supra co-leader, and then got promoted to Supra leader. What about Panther? I was in Synergy, bro, bro. Ruski? Uh, Illusion. Illusion, okay, and then BC? I was in A7. You're in A7? I was in A7. Okay, and what uh, made you guys leave? Um, I, I say Supra's wreck. I just like always loved Supra, and like if you've been in the community for a while, like and you knew Supra Gaming, like when they first were like a team and they were like on their first first gen, like they were on the same level as Phase. Like you get into a game with Supra and you'd be like, oh my god, I'm in a game with Supra. Yeah, and just like that, yeah, Supra's being really well respected in the community. Yeah, and I just thought we'd have a great comeback. And like no hard feelings to Bionic or anything, I just thought it would be the best decision for myself. So. Yeah. Yeah, that makes sense. Okay, now next question is going to go to all you. So do you guys feel that Supra is a really family-orientated team? Like, do you, is, there's no beef in the team? You guys are all, like, you know, friends? Uh, uh, with, with being the person that's taking care of most of the fights in the chat, that there has been one, it, it all depends on who you are. Like, we have a few players 
feel they, they, feel can, they can do it as they, they please, please, no matter what. what. Like, like, said to them, them even by a leader. leader. Yeah. The rest of them overall, overall they all, they all joke around, around in the chat and, the chat and, and all that stuff and just have fun. Yeah, that's cool. Okay. Uh, nice do you guys plan on doing any recruitment challenges in the near future? Uh, we have, uh, talked, we have about talked about doing a recruitment challenge at either 50k, if we hit a certain amount of likes on a camp or something. Just that, uh, we have a, like, in our leaders chat, like our own super leaders chat, we've been talking about some ideas and some, uh, cool things to get the players going, like, uh, like I told one of the, I told the players today, if they do good in this, uh, challenge, we'll be doing our own, like, in the team thing just to help us out and everything like that. Yeah. But, uh, so, yeah, we've been, we've been, uh, Thinking of some thinking cool, of cool stuff, stuff to start, to start up, up that, that the players, players don't have an idea, idea about yet, yet, but we'll, we'll, we'll reveal we'll it over time. time. Yeah, okay. And uh, what's the best way for people to contact you guys if they have any questions or concerns? eBay, dude. I'm just kidding. <laughs> uh, I'd say pretty much the most common three, my personal channel, Skype, or Twitter. Okay, I'll be adding those in the description below if any of you guys want to contact Super White. And yeah, um, yeah. what is your what is your team specialize in? Are you guys more of feeders, more of trick shotters, or a little of both? Say more, more trick, trick shotters, shotters, but we do we have, have a kick ass, ass feeding ass team. If you couldn't tell by the team's touch, yeah, it was pretty dirty. I wish it would have been some been different, different songs, songs as White Nose, White but <laughs> I wish it would have been the longer. Change, change. And when Go was back. Super? When was Super created? Like, do any of you know, like, when the first, like, generation of Super was created? So, uh, it, was, it, was made, it was made around two and a half years ago, actually. Oh, really? It was made around, like, I don't want to say the same time as, like, Fade, but it was made around, like, the same time as Dark. Yeah. How many players Fade. are in Super right now? Oh, I know the answer to that. There's 43, 43 players. players. Oh, wow, okay. We, we, we have, have, like, that was another thing that we talked, talked about in the chat. There's going to be some clearing out going on in this next week of what's going on right now. Like, yeah. we told the players, you made the team, but now you got to show that you can stay in the team. That's kind of the thing. And then we're going to come down to our final roster, and I thought this was a great thing we talked about between the leaders. Like, it's a... Uh, it's, it was very smart, I think, what we did to get a big roster in the beginning, see what like what we have. Now we can start, I don't, I don't want to say this bad because the players are here, but we can start getting rid of some players that just aren't up to the standards that we want, Yeah. just not as good as the players that we have overall. Okay, yeah. Um, Alright, so since Super White is a leader and Super BC's co-leader, do you guys mainly just manage the team or do you guys also make your own episodes for the team also or what do you guys do oh, I all right well i, I went from being a player and i just I recently kind of started, started leading like from tsu i joined tsu as co-leader and that was like first major clan that i started co-leading or leading and then i worked my way up to leader of tsu and then, and then Jetty, Jetty was co-leader of Supra, Supra, and he helped me get into Supra, he talked, he talked to Sonny, and, and I joined as a co-leader, and then I worked my way up to leader just by proving myself and recruiting and helping out. So yeah, I'll, still be, I'll still be I'll still be planning on putting out episodes, however, it's just a, lot, a little bit more difficult because like, I'm more busy on Skype and I have to be more active because yeah. I'm a leader and not only a player, so I try and respond to everyone, but... Yeah, and, so I'll, I'll be trying to put out episodes that they might be a little more delayed. Yeah. Uh, okay, for me, about seven, seven months ago, ago I, was I was always, always a player. player. I got into A7. I was a player for the longest time. Became team, team, team captain. I started doing like jobs as a co-leader. I quit for a little while, and I came back and scared so I could still be a part of A7. So I was like managing the team, like taking care of the chat, recruiting, stuff like that. And then uh, suddenly we started Supra, and came, I just came here, and I left A7 for that. And I'll still be putting out episodes. I actually just put one out like like a week ago. But I'll, I, I still try to put mine out at least once a month with leading. And so I, I still play. I still put clips in for cams and team tosh and stuff like that. Yeah, okay. So that's good. Okay, well, that wraps up this interview with Team Supra. Do you guys have anything you guys want to tell the fans? Uh, uh, I, do, I do, at least. At least uh, uh, I want to thank wanna you thank guys, guys for, uh, for uh, basically 45K, 45K subs. subs. That's actually a huge deal. And also, also to contact, contact me, the easiest, easiest way, way is probably, probably through YouTube. YouTube. And if you are going to try to add my Skype, if you find the right, right one, one, 
make sure you have a name that I know to add so I don't have to worry about like a hacker or something like that. And just overall, that's, that's it for me. I want to thank you guys for all the good feedback and all the stuff in our camp, our promo, and our team ties. Okay, yeah. Ruski, Panther, White, do you guys have anything? Do you guys have anything you guys want to say to the fans? Pretty much the same thing as BC, just thanks for all your support with the team ties, the cams, the promo. really means a lot, and we'll be trying to put out our best content we can. Okay. Thank you, guys. <laughs> I have a thing to say after that first we had nothing. Okay, well, this, okay, this has been NS Relapse with Team Supra. Have a wonderful day. Peace. 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 And there you guys have it. That was a super team interview. Their subscriber count on their channel is 45,996 plus. And the leader is Super Sunny. If you guys are interested in checking out their channel or checking out their most viewed video, please check out the description below. Okay, and as you guys know, after every team interview, we're going to do a little bit of news on the team. So the video that we chose to do the news on is actually the featured video. And is the video of the leader Super Sunny. It's going to be his comeback episode. Let's check it out. I went hard in the classroom Simply cause I had my sights set around past June Graduated chilling hard in the afternoons Contemplating verses that I put onto a track soon Ay, I went hard with my last tune Dropped the outsider cause I knew that I'd be back soon And there you guys have a big cheers to the leader of Super for that amazing episode So if you guys want to check out his channel It's going to be in the description below His subscriber count on that channel is 1738 plus And yeah, Super Sunny, there you have it um, um, he's an amazing leader. He's been leading for a really long time. Supra, you know, Supra's on break and now they're back and, you know, he's leading. So make sure to go and uh, stop by Supra Gaming too. And that's going to wrap up this team interview, guys. It's been NS Relapse. And guys, if you're interested, we are looking for a news team that can commentate. And we're going to be looking for watermarks and news grids. So if you're interested in any of those, uh, please contact SLBOG on the YouTube. This has been NS Relapse. Have a wonderful day.